Hey everyone, I'm Megan Sullivan and welcome to my weekly RPG Roundup, where I highlight some of the biggest video game RPG news announced during the week. And what a week to kick things off. There's a lot of RPG news for the week of April 2020, so let's get started. This week Square Enix announced that Final Fantasy VII will be released early in Europe and Australia. According to the publisher, due to COVID-19, they've had disruption to their distribution channels that make it difficult to align the timing of their global shipping of the game. However, the team at Square Enix still wants everyone to be able to play the game by the original launch date of April 10th, and thus decided to release the game early to players in Europe and Australia to make that possible. By the way, they also just dropped a new trailer for the game this week, but viewer be warned, there are potential old and new spoilers in it. You can check it out over on the Twitter feed of Square Enix at Square Enix, one word. A digital RKO out of nowhere, the Nier team announced Nier Replicant version 1.22474487139, an upgraded version of the original Nier, now in development for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and Steam. And let me just say, as a huge Nier fan, I am stoked. You can check out that trailer on the developer's official Twitter account, at Nier Game. Yes, it's one word. Surprise! The Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 4 was announced. According to the description I found over on IGN.com, with a nation on the brink of war and their greatest light now missing, heroes from far and wide must stand together in the face of emerging threats when the Legend of Heroes Trails of Cold Steel 4 arrives on PlayStation 4 in fall 2020 and on Nintendo Switch and PC in 2021. A new action RPG by indie studio Cold Symmetry called Mortal Shell was announced, which looks very Soulsborne-y. The game is set to release for PlayStation 4, Xbox One, and PC in Q3 2020. And finally, according to RPGsite.net, a string of RPGs came out this week. Persona 5 Royale dropped to stellar reviews, Mountain Blade 2 Bannerlord is now out on Steam Early Access, Operencia The Stolen Sun, a dungeon crawler, is out on Steam, PlayStation 4, and Nintendo Switch, and an enhanced edition of Era Felon on the Nintendo Switch is now available. What RPGs are you playing right now, or looking forward to playing in the future? Let me know by dropping a comment below. Thanks so much for watching guys, see you next week!